Happy Friday. So this week I've been exploring the first five um, areas that I believe, not we should, we must focus on uh, if we are as an organisation to survive. This is the new era of self-determination. Employees know what they want and they're looking for it and they're in the driving seat. And unless we sit up and listen to what they are asking, the competition is going to be way ahead of us and we will be a speck in their rear view mirror. We'll be eating their dust and I'm sure you don't want that. So we need to change the focus to the things that employees are looking for. Employees want these things. They want to be motivated. They want to be able to innovate. They want autonomy. They want um, an organisation that makes sure that they're resilient and, and that they have a, an agile mindset and approach to, uh, to work. So I wanted to wrap up this week with collaboration. And this is even more important now that uh, many organisations have a remote or hybrid workforce. And what was found by some research that Microsoft did um, when the pandemic hit, and they had some data about collaboration before the pandemic across their organisation, they found that once the pandemic hit, the collaboration within teams was maintained and if not necessarily increased, but the collaboration outside the teams decreased. And that was probably the team, you know, pulling in the ranks, looking after each other and the outer team, inter-team uh, collaboration decreased. And that can't be allowed to continue because that stops knowledge sharing. And if we have silos and lack of knowledge sharing across the organisation, that's dangerous. And the organisation is going to stagnate. So we need to encourage not only intra-team collaboration, but inter-team collaboration. And the leadership in the organisation needs to actively drive cross-team cross-functional collaboration where diverse teams get together who've probably never worked before to collaborate on a particular initiative activity or task and that in turn needs empathy and communication and listening skills as well as collaboration skills there is no room for silos now in organisations, they have to be, have to be broken down and collaboration will be key to survival. Talk to you next week. Bye.